I'm Eileen Wilson and today's Tech Girl tidbit is on base size. When starting a new apparel line, one of the critical decisions to make is the base size for development and fitting, and there are several things to consider. What is the total size range going to be? From a fit and grading perspective, it's best to fit in the middle of your range. So if you are running extra small to extra large, medium would be the ideal base size. If you require salesman samples, what size do they need to be? And if you intend to do wear testing, what is the ideal testing size? Sales samples and wear tests are usually done prior to production fit approval, so grading to additional sizes may not be cost effective and can create a lot of extra work if styles continue to evolve throughout the development and approval process. If you intend to be more inclusive in your sizing, it is worth considering moving as close to the middle of the range as possible for your base size. Even minor fit or balance issues can become exaggerated the further you get away from the base. If design and fit intention are not properly maintained across the size range due to skewing, this could have a negative impact on customer satisfaction and, of course, sales. Choose a base size that best supports the brand's design intention, target consumer demographics, and development needs.